Welcome, fellow tech enthusiasts, to Tech Nation. In today's video, we're going to take a stroll down memory lane and explore the evolution of a device that changed the way we listen to music. The Walkman. From the days of cassette tapes to the convenience of Spotify playlists, we'll dive into the technological advancements that have made music more portable and accessible than ever before. So, grab your headphones and get ready to groove with us as we explore the journey of the Walkman, with our trademark witty twist. The Walkman, a device that revolutionized the way we consumed music on the go. But before we dive into its significance, let's take a brief walk through history. The Walkman was first introduced by Sony in 1979 and was initially called the Soundabout in the United States and the Stowaway in the United Kingdom. It was a portable cassette player that allowed users to listen to music on the move without the need for bulky equipment. It quickly gained popularity and became a cultural phenomenon of the 80s and 90s. Now, let's talk about its importance in the evolution of music technology. The Walkman paved the way for the development of portable music players, which eventually led to the birth of the MP3 player and the rise of digital music. It transformed the way we listen to music and made it possible for us to take our tunes with us wherever we went. The Walkman also played a significant role in shaping pop culture. It became a status symbol and a fashion statement, with people customizing their devices with stickers and accessories. It even inspired the creation of the Walkman effect a term used to describe the phenomenon of people becoming so absorbed in their music that they are unaware of their surroundings. So, while the Walkman may seem like a relic of the past, its impact on the world of music and technology is undeniable. It was a game-changer that allowed us to experience music in a whole new way and opened the door to countless innovations that we still enjoy today. The development of the first Walkman was a momentous achievement in the world of music technology, the idea was sparked by Sony co-founder Masaru Abuka, who wanted to create a portable cassette player that was small and light enough to fit in his pocket. After several prototypes, the first Walkman, the TPSL2, was released in Japan in 1979. It was an instant success and quickly became a global phenomenon. The impact of the Walkman on the music industry cannot be overstated. It allowed people to listen to music wherever they wanted which meant that the demand for portable music skyrocketed. This led to an increase in the production of cassette tapes and the birth of the mixtape culture. It also opened up new markets for the music industry and provided opportunities for emerging artists to reach wider audiences. The rise of cassette tapes and their compatibility with the Walkman was a match made in heaven, which made them a perfect fit for the portable music player. They were also cheaper than vinyl records, which meant that people could afford to buy more music. The Walkman and cassette tapes formed a symbiotic relationship that lasted for decades. The introduction of portable CD players was a natural evolution of music technology. After the success of the Walkman, it was only a matter of time before CD technology became portable. The first portable CD player, the Sony Discman, was released in 1984 and quickly became a must-have gadget for music lovers. CD players had several advantages over cassette tapes. They offered better sound quality, longer playing times, and the ability to skip tracks easily. However, they also had their disadvantages. They were bulkier and heavier than cassette players, and they skipped easily if you moved them around too much. And let's not forget the struggle of carrying around a CD case full of your favorite albums. The evolution of technology has led to smaller and more portable devices, and CD players were no exception. Mini CD players and MP3 players soon took over the market, offering even more portability and convenience. Today, we have music at our fingertips with the rise of streaming services like Spotify and Apple Music. It's amazing to see how far technology has come, from carrying around a stack of cassette tapes to having access to millions of songs on our smartphones. But let's not forget the humble CD player and its contribution to the evolution of music technology. Even if it did require a bit of patience when it came to loading and unloading CDs, it was still a game-changer in its time. The first MP3 player, the MP Man, was released in 1998 by a Korean company called Saiyan Information Systems. It had a storage capacity of only 32 megabytes, which meant you could only fit a handful of songs on it, but it was still a game-changer in the world of music technology. MP3 players had several advantages over CD players. 
For one, they were much smaller and lighter, which made them more portable. They also had a much larger storage capacity, which meant you could carry around thousands of songs in your pocket. And let's not forget the ease of transferring music. No more burning CDs or carrying around a stack of them. Plus, you could create your own playlists and shuffle songs at the touch of a button. The impact of MP3 players on the music industry was huge. They paved the way for the rise of digital music and online music stores like iTunes. They also made it easier for independent artists to distribute their music and for listeners to discover new music. However, they also had their downsides. Illegal downloading and piracy became a major issue, leading to a decline in album sales for record labels. Overall, the introduction of the MP3 player was a significant moment in music technology history, its impact can still be felt today in the rise of streaming services like Spotify and Apple Music. And let's not forget the satisfaction of being able to carry around your entire music library in your pocket, it's a feeling that never gets old. Ah, the world of streaming services. A paradise for music lovers or a never-ending rabbit hole. Let's dive in and take a look at the introduction, benefits, drawbacks, and impact of streaming services on the music industry. Streaming services like Spotify and Apple Music were introduced in the early 2010s, and they quickly became the go-to platforms for music streaming. These services allowed users to access a vast library of songs, create playlists, and discover new music without having to buy individual albums or songs. The benefits of streaming services are undeniable. They offer convenience, accessibility, and affordability. With a monthly subscription fee, users can access millions of songs from a variety of genres, create personalized playlists, and even download songs for offline listening. However, there are also some drawbacks to these services. Some argue that they devalue music by offering it at such a low cost, and there are concerns about the compensation of artists and the impact on the music industry. The impact of streaming services on the music industry has been significant. On the one hand, they have helped to increase the accessibility and popularity of music, especially for independent artists who may not have had a platform before. On the other hand, they have also led to a decline in physical album sales, which has had a significant impact on record labels and the music industry as a whole. Additionally, there are ongoing debates about the compensation of artists and the fairness of the streaming business model, Overall, streaming services have had a significant impact on the music industry, and they continue to shape the way we consume and discover music. Whether you're a die-hard vinyl collector or a streaming addict, there's no denying that the accessibility and convenience of streaming services have changed the game. Ah, music technology. A world of innovation and creativity that's constantly evolving. Let's take a stroll down memory lane and explore the impact of the Walkman on music technology the evolution of music technology, and what the future holds. As for the future of music technology, the possibilities are endless. We could see advancements in AI and virtual reality technology that could change the way we experience music. We may see new ways of creating and producing music, from collaborative platforms to AI-generated compositions. The rise of NFTs and blockchain technology could also change the way artists and fans interact with music. The potential for innovation is limitless. But as with any new development, there are also concerns about the impact on the music industry. Will these new technologies devalue music even further? Will they lead to a decline in physical album sales? Will they make it even harder for emerging artists to break through? These are all questions that the industry will have to grapple with in the coming years. Overall, the evolution of music technology has been a wild and exciting ride. From the Walkman to streaming services, each new development has offered something new and exciting. And while the future of music technology is uncertain, one thing is for sure, the industry will continue to innovate and push boundaries in the pursuit of new and exciting ways to experience and enjoy music.